Okay, this is the ogre from madogre.com and weedthearm.com. And I'm here with uh, Headshot Willie, Father Frank, and Corn from We The Arm. And we're testing out some, uh, some special custom made ammo. This is kind of like a Corbon Powerball, but not. And we're trying to, and uh, we're going to shoot some wet pack, see how that works. This is a 45 ACP, 230 grains, and uh, we'll see what this does. It's a real windy day at the Buckskin, so uh, we got to get this going. You're ready. Okay. amount of uh, hydrostatic shock that opened up that entry wall. Now I wonder how far the BB went. Excellent penetration. Look at how well that stayed together. That's quite a bit of a slug left there. Yeah, hardly any uh, loss. Loss of weight. And the penetration was excellent. We've got... Man, it had to be a good foot into that bucket. 12 inches of wet pack would be about... Probably about 14 inches of ballistic gel, depending on the saturation. And this this paper here is good and saturated. It's been soaking for a week. Let's try uh, something. Okay, we've got a 308. Willie, what kind of load is this? This is the 147 grain M80. Uh, military bullet with 44 grains of uh, bargette. It's a stout load. This should be impressive. Ready? Ready. <laughs> well, <laughs> check the bottom of the bucket. that we shot it's steel core it's designed for penetration armor piercing and uh, you got some and we saw that that's what a rifle does okay this is a PSL in 762 by 54R had some expansion or something going on. I wish we could find it. Yeah. Good luck with that. But about the same as the 308 really. Okay, 
Now this is a 12 gauge. Military police. I've got it loaded with a slug. Where's the zoom on this bad boy? Hey, it landed on me. Look. Oh, it landed a piece of it landed in my hand. It went up my shirt sleeve. Nice. Oh my goodness. That's a five gallon bucket full of newsprint, soaked for a week. Just devastating. But it looks like it's gone, baby. No, <laughs> oh, it just blasted. Gauge. Look at the wet pack over here, like the entry. It just, it just blew it up. <laughs> we should have saved that for last. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think it's last now. I think, I think that was last. <laughs> oh, good grief! Just devastating. The power of the 12. The power of the gauge. Good. Boy, I can think of a few people that... And that's a 12 gauge out of a Mossberg 930 SPX tactical. Fantastic weapon platform. It is becoming my favorite 12 gauge. It is right up there with my beloved 870. And I don't know where that slug would have entered the berm. The berm. But it definitely... Uh, pass through that bucket. Okay, just because that was so much fun, we're going to do that again. I'm going to get up here just a little bit sideways of it, George. Okay, I'm good, George. Go for it. <laughs> Look at this. It like puked. Oh man. That's awesome. Okay, I did a kind of a higher angle. But did it penetrate all the way through? Probably not quite an ounce. There's probably another chunk somewhere, but good grief. Yeah. Well, these are the Winchester Super X, two and three quarter inch, one ounce load, with an estimated muzzle velocity of 1600 feet per second. And it just obliterated that wet. It's not even holding together anymore. Can't it? That's the fun stuff right there.